Hey guys! Hello. <laughs> We're taking a shopping trip and we are going to... That's a drum roll. REI! <laughs> <laughs> We're going to look for some wilderness stuff and some stuff for a new video. Um, we're going to buy and try out um, freeze-dried meals. There are a lot of different companies, a lot of different um, kinds, and so yeah, we're gonna go buy some. We're gonna go try some out because uh, we have some fun videos coming up and we need to know, you know, it's gonna be best. We love hiking, we love camping, so we gotta try them out. We gotta figure out which one's the best. Here we go. Chicken Alfredo pasta tonight. Looks pretty good. This one's from Peak Refuel. And basically how you make these is you boil water and then you put it in here and then it waits for a certain amount of time. I think this one is 10 minutes. So we're about to put that in. Our dog's right here. Hello. Okay. I'm going to have to do like two of these and like a little bit extra in there I think a little bit more I always do this I always go over the top okay so we got that in there and then what we're supposed to do is mix it so I'm gonna get out a big spoon oh my gosh that looks so good why does that look so good holy cow that looks yummy just mix it up a little bit and then it says you have to close the pouch a few moments later we're done it's done it's done i'm so excited i'm really actually i'm really excited i really think it's gonna taste good <gasps> yeah do the noodles look done the noodles look pretty done actually wow that's and there's a lot of chicken in it too it's honestly shocking how good that looks that looks so mm. freaking good are we gonna fall in love with this and need to eat it every day? It's our first bite. I'm really nervous. I feel like it's gonna be kind of bland, but. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Scale of one to 10. Uh, seven. I think it needs some garlic salt and then it'll be good. I'm going to put some on mine. That's another thing is that when you're hiking, you have to figure out how to do like spices. Like you got to figure out how to bring spices. I think I've seen a couple, a couple people figure out creative ways to bring some spice on the, some people carry it in a bag, in a Ziploc bag. Should we get Ziploc bags full of garlic? <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> it's good. It's pretty good. All right, here is my first, first bite, bite of the freezer dried. Gotta get some chicken on that one. Mm. How is it? Honestly, tastes like red lobster fettuccine. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> red lobster, really? It's oh, that yeah. good? You really think it's that good? Yep, I enjoy it a lot. Yeah. Um, I don't you think it could use a little bit of garlic though? I mean, it tastes fine to me, but... <laughs> You're already eating it. Oh, yeah. You're, like, it's into gone. it. <laughs> All right. So it is the next day, and we are going to be trying the Summit Breakfast Scramble. That's Backpacker's um, Pantry. Backpacker's Pantry is the <laughs> brand. Um, yes, yeah, so we got the water boiling, and we will check back in a sec. This is the freeze-dried. Looks so weird. Looks super weird. There's not a ton. This is a single serving. So we're going to... Uh, we're just going to sample it. Yeah. We're going to split it. We're going to eat other things okay. as well. One, two... All right. Now we uh, stir it up. 
let it sit for about Start eight minutes or so, wait. and then we We'll start up again and then wait another seven minutes. All right, we tried the eggs. My hair is like crazy today. We tried the eggs. Um, I don't like it. I'm like not really an egg person anyways. I don't really like eggs. So he's going to eat it this morning. I enjoyed it. I thought it was pretty good. Good amount of spice flavor. A little too runny though, but... Oh, well. Yeah, it's a little bit runny, but there we have it. There's our egg scramble. What would mm. you rate it? Um, put it a seven or eight out of ten. I will give it a three. Okay. I don't really like it. Sorry. Instead, this morning I'm going to try the honey stinger waffle. We're gonna try it. <laughs> Here we go. I don't know, it tastes pretty normal. Tastes like honey. It's pretty good. You wanna try a bite? Sure. Tastes pretty good. Oh. Tastes pretty good. Uh six out of ten. Sure. All right, so we are about to make dinner. We're making the sweet and sour grilled chicken. Um, this is what it looks like before the water is added. There's the water boiling. It only, it takes two cups of boiling water and then you zip it up and let it sit for about 10 to 12 minutes. All right, it's been about 12 minutes or so. There it is. We're about to uh, dish it up and serve it. All right, uh, it is all served up and divvied up. It did say that it was for two servings. So me and Mer are going to be trying this out and maybe having it for dinner. So here is the first bite. Not bad. It is pretty sweet, which kind of throws me off a little bit. The texture's kind of weird, but I think overall it's pretty good. Um, what about a five or six out of ten? All right, so I just brought uh, the food to Murr, and here is her first bite. <laughs> it smells good. It's a little... I get nervous about peppers. I don't do well with spice. They're bell peppers. They don't know how spicy. Mmm. 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 <laughs> That's weird. It really is weird. That's so weird. I don't know if I like this one. Mmm. <laughs> I don't know if I like this one. Yeah, I'd say overall not the best um this one and the scramble this morning they're a little weird we really hyped um, ourselves up with the yeah fettuccine. i mean yeah i think we should have that was a bad move we should have had the fettuccine last because yeah. the fettuccine was the best and it i don't know for sure overall it was just one of the, the top meals that we had um, we do plan on getting a different variety of meals next time we go to REI. Um, yeah. And then for dessert, we have an ice cream sandwich. So I think that'll be pretty good too. Um, I'm excited for that one. Yeah. So this is Mountain House. This is the ice cream sandwich. Uh, it's just got vanilla ice cream and the two chocolatey wafers. And we're gonna try that next, so. It's literally just an ice cream sandwich, but freeze dried, so. I mean, I'm hoping it, it'll taste okay, or taste like an ice cream sandwich, I don't know. So we got, I chopped it in half, and we got crumbs everywhere, so. I'm scared. You go first. 
smells like it's an ice cream. Probably not gonna smell. It like smells that. like an ice cream sandwich. Yeah. It's good. Taste is good. Texture is weird. It's like you're, it's like you're biting into like a sponge, but it tastes like an ice cream sandwich. <laughs> I like don't know how to describe it. falling apart in its hands. I'd say it's like a like a more bland marshmallow mateys marshmallow. I like it. I think it's good. I'll give it an eight or nine out of ten. That's pretty good. Yeah. There you have it. Ice cream sandwich. Pretty good. So what do you think on a scale of zero to ten overall the freeze dried foods? I'd have to give it overall like a five out of 10. The, I ended up not liking the eggs and yeah. ended up not liking the sweet and sour chicken, but I really did like the fettuccine and the ice cream sandwich. Yes. But. Yeah, I'd rate it maybe like a four. I mean, obviously it's not meant for like every day. It's not meant to be, you know, a luxurious meal, but um, they were pretty okay filling. They have a lot of protein, so they filled up, I mean, a lot, but you have to eat a lot when you're on the trail, when you're doing what you're doing, backpacking, anything like that, you have to eat a lot. So, but yeah, some of them, we're iffy, which is why we're trying them out now. Yeah. That's why we. That's why you need to try them out before you actually take a trip, and then you're stuck with ten scrambled eggs, <laughs> ten bags of scrambled eggs that you don't want to eat. Thank you guys so much for checking out our video. We had so much fun. We are working on um, more outdoorsy content stuff that we're looking forward to in the future, some travel stuff, we're very excited. Um, if you guys did enjoy it, please leave a like, uh, subscribe, comment, um, but yeah, thank you again for watching us and hope you guys have a great day.